It's a terrific Tuesday, August 20th, 2024. Thank you for watching Marketplace Today. I'm Lamaya Polina. We have a great show. Let's get into our talkers, shall we? So, it is com it's a common trend these days for people to often like to scroll through a bunch of videos on TikTok or YouTube. And while some people may swipe through a lot of videos because they feel bored, new research shows skipping around a lot of going or going backwards and forwards on the same video actually makes people even more bored. Researchers at the University of Toronto performed two experiments on about 1,200 people. So during the first trial, People could watch a 10 minute video without interruption, followed by 10 minutes where they could switch between uh, seven five minute videos. In the second trial, people could view a 10 minute video straight, then could fast forward or rewind through a 50 minute video. Now the study found participants who watched the straight video, uh, or video straight through, felt more engaged and satisfied than skipping around. I mean, there's no wonder why our attention span is like 30 seconds now. Not even 30 seconds, that was like 10 seconds for those videos on TikTok. All right, moving on. Uh, many Disney super fans and bloggers are complaining about the high cost of vacationing at the happiest place on earth. Uh, in response, Disney is offering a wider range of pricing and some option deals. Uh, tourists can also expect a bigger bang for their buck with new, many new parades and shows added to the existing attractions. According to Josh DeMauro, chairperson of the Walt Disney Parks and Resorts, the theme park giant will provide as much access and flexibility as possible. Disney has also touted lower price ticket options as value season deals and its resort hotels to allow families to visit even if they're on a tight budget. At the same time, the Disney or the week Disney announced plans for an avalanche of attractions and land and its parks. More themes and uh, deals are coming our way. All right. Now, you know, we just ended the Illinois State Fair, but in Iowa, a beloved state fair tradition kicked off Wednesday, the ladies rubber chicken throwing contest. So this was about last week. Uh, participants took turns to see who could fling the seven pound featherless fowl the farthest. Take a look at your screen. The ladies rubber chicken throwing champion wowed the crowd with a 57 foot toss. Now, if you're wondering why they're throwing chickens, well, the Illinois State Fair said it's used to be a rolling pin throwing contest. That's until contestants rolling pin fling went crashing through windshields of a police car. So it took for the police cars to get broken for them to now throw chickens 57 feet far, might I add. All right. <laughs> Those are your talkers for today. We have an amazing show up ahead. People stay here. Marketplace is back in two. Thanks for watching. Stick around by subscribing today and don't miss a single video.